Yes, we are. Oh, my goodness. Ted Lasso season three is almost upon us. Would you like to talk to somebody on the show? <laughs> Would we? <laughs> Stephon Mattis joining us right now, the very handsome Richard from Ted Lasso. How are you, friend? Hello, guys. Thank you for having me. Hi. Nice to meet you, buddy. <laughs> Sorry for my voice, but yesterday I was on my first football game, not soccer, oh. LAFC. And they won 4 nil, so I had to scream a lot to chill the team. Thank you for wearing the shirt of Ted Lasso. I appreciate it. Thank you're you. welcome. You're welcome. Okay, what has it been like being on this show? We know in America it's a huge hit. In England it's a big hit, but back at home in France, is it a hit as well? <gasps> oh! No? Uh, we, don't, we don't have Apple TV much, to be honest. Oh, okay. Uh, it's, but it's mainly Netflix and Amazon having all the bits and... Um, Apple TV is not that developed, unfortunately. They have wonderful show, but it's going to come. It's going to come. It's going to come. It's going to come. Yeah, that's right. Uh, so tell us a little bit about season three. What can you tell us? What are we going to see without somebody uh, helicoptering in and, and, and beating up both of us? Well, um, I think the, the series is going to expand a lot. And the fact that the fan loved the show so much, so much and it has been a huge hit, I think maybe, I don't, I don't know much, to be honest, it's... Uh, it unchanged the potential of the writer, like uh, maybe Apple or whoever is producing it, had a lot of more trust into the uh, the writers okay. and Jason and everybody in the team. So just YOLO, okay, do whatever you want. Uh, we trust the people love it. So they just they have just expanded it. Sorry for my English. In other way possible, more football, uh, more relationships, more great uh, storylines, and uh, it's going to be brilliant. I'm sure people are going to love it. Oh, I cannot wait. Cannot wait. You were talking a little bit about, you know, you're French. The cast is international. Yep. You know, was there any language barriers? Did Jason Sudeikis kind of help you out with that? Actually, yeah, actually, right. Um, okay, right now you can hear. Sorry. You can hear my English is, is much better after three years in London, obviously. But the first days, as I don't speak English much on the show, uh, sorry, in Paris, in my country. It was a little hard for me as an American um, to speak quite fast. And um, many times, I mean, Jason spotted it and I'm like, oh, dang, what is it? What, which di direction? What is he saying to me? And it's like, he came to me and said, Stefan, every time you don't, you don't understand. You're not quite sure. Just come to me or anybody. We're going to speak slowly, we're going to try to translate, and we're going to help you out. So, yeah, in the beginning a little, but after a couple of months, uh, not anymore. And, well, actually, maybe I'm lying a little. Even the last day of season three, sometime I'm like, I, I'm, I'm not quite sure. But they're all so understandable of the fact that we're not from the same countries. Cristo, Mexico, David from, um, from Netherlands. Uh -huh. So... It's not a barrier, it just brings people together and sometimes we, we don't really understand. So actually it's quite fun. We don't lose too much time, it's okay. Fantastic, fantastic. Can't wait to see season three, my friend. Congratulations. Neither. Neither. I know, it's gonna be so exciting, it's so exciting. Thanks for joining us. I'm hyped, Welcome. as you can tell. I got my, I got my kid day. on. I love your shirt. <laughs> Thank Wonderful. you very much. I will have it. Thank you. <laughs> That's all. <laughs> Thank, Thank you so much. Thank you so much, guys. All right, back to you. He is quite charming. Very easy on the eyes, yes. and the accent working for me. Yeah. So there's that. Yeah, yeah. The easiness on the eyes. Yeah. You know, it was quite helpful. Totally. Right. Totally. I might have to watch the show now. <laughs>